What's up, man? What's up? Good, Good to, to see, see you. you. You too. Okay, so now where have you been? I haven't seen you since last year. Last time I saw you, you was here in LA, but y'all left for a while, right? Yeah, so for Christmas, for my Christmas break, uh, I went to Houston, and that's where I was born, my hometown. I spent Houston. Christmas there with my family. I saw my old house that I used to live in when I was in Houston. Uh, okay. And I've okay. just been working on projects and getting my YouTube channel ready. Okay, speaking of projects, now, what's, can you tell me, I know you got something with Netflix, right? Can you tell me about yeah. that? So, I have a Netflix movie. It's confidential, but it's confidential. Confidential? I can't really tell you the name or anything. Yeah. <laughs> I, I want to know the name, what time I can watch it. I got to tell you to stay tuned, my bad. <laughs> stay tuned, the famous oh. GoFam quote. <laughs> okay, um, are you still in GoFam? Yeah, I'm still in GoFam. I'm, wait, what is it called? What do they call it? Uh, old school. I think I'm part of the old school. <laughs> oh, old school. You're, you're like an OG. Yeah, OG, OG goat. There you go. <laughs> you're an OG I'm an old goat. goat. <laughs> I'm an old goat. <laughs> you, I've never gotten to ask you, and for the fans out there that maybe don't know, how did you actually initially connect with Goat Fan? Okay, so, like, Four or three years ago, I worked with Gavin on a DreamWorks project. And um, we had like a connection with your friends for those past years. And then this August, he invited me to be a part of the GOAT fam, which was fantastic for me. Because I was like, because <laughs> me as myself, I'm more of a improv. I'm goofy. I like to just say stuff. Yeah. <laughs> that makes no sense most of the time, but I just like to say stuff. <laughs> and so he invited me to be part of the GOAT fam. And I said, sure. And you was like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you are an actor. Sure. That's how I said. Okay. Sure. Okay. So now, I, okay. Now I know that. Now, you know, obviously I got yeah. some tea questions for you. Yep. <laughs> okay. It's, I feel like you and I are forever linked now because of that Brooklyn <laughs> live. Yep. Okay. So now I saw that live, right? I had just got done interviewing Brooklyn, like literally just got done interviewing Brooklyn. And so I saw the live and I was like, let me, let me see what's going on. They're probably going to like be promoting the interview that her manager had me do. And I see you guys going at it. And I thought it was a bad look for both of y'all. I didn't like how you looked, and I couldn't believe the way she was just attacking you and going after you, you know, and, and I saw you, you were stumbling. I was like, mm. so I put an emoji there and man, that caused all kind of crap to break loose. Yeah. What happened with you in Brooklyn and this whole goat fam thing is racist? What is this all about? Okay, so first of all, the Darnell name, what they were talking about is not black enough. So, okay, so my sister, she's working on this project. And you know how like on movies and TV shows and stuff like that, every character has, every person has their own name? Yes. Basically, that was my name. My name was Darnell. And when they were all calling me Darnell, because Coco came up with a name, when they were calling me Darnell, even the old people were calling me Darnell, okay. and like when they were calling me Darnell, Miss Teresa was like, she, you know, she's Gavin's mom. She was like, who's Darnell? Because she didn't know anything about Darnell until everybody started saying Darnell. So they okay. were calling me Darnell. So I had nothing, to, nothing to do with it. It was just Coco made that name because from Chicken Girls, you know the boys yeah. from Chicken Girls? Yeah. I know Chicken Girls. Darnell. I love the Chicken Girls. <laughs> yeah. That's, they're calling him Darnell. That's his actor. Okay. Thing, so, yeah. Because I got confused because, you know, I'm getting all these messages and, you know, all those people's fans are attacking me and there's like alleged leaked messages. And I'm like, whoa, whatever's happening here is definitely not kind. But <laughs> I just interview people. I like them. I like you guys. I just talk to everybody. I like you. So, <laughs> thank you, man. <laughs> and so... And so basically what I'm trying to figure out is this. So now I've known Teresa and Gavin for about five or six years or so, you know, yeah. and I've never met anyone who ever thought they were racist. And so I'm like, okay, it seems to me like there was other issues going on in the family or in the squad. What was going on behind the scenes that made everybody so mad? Uh... I'm not really sure what made everybody so mad behind the scenes. I mean, like we were all, we all had a great 
And uh, the last time I saw the old gold members that left the squad, we were like all chilling in the bunker at the continent, and we were just talking, making TikToks, having fun. So I don't know what caused the the rift. change. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, do you still talk to anyone that left the group? Uh, no, but. I wouldn't say we're enemies. I'd say I don't hold grudges or like enemies or anything like that. I would just say I'm just neutral with them. Okay. Yeah. Um, I, I'm going to say hi to them too. I'll still talk to you too. They mad at me, I believe, but any of y'all want to talk to me, of course I talk to you. Um, okay. <laughs> now, your sister is also an actress. Yeah. She's a way I, better I, actress than I am. <laughs> that's that's so funny because what I was gonna ask you is, do you guys ever compete on who's the better actor? She's such a good actor. She's <laughs> she's in. Uh, so you can go check her out. Her name is Kyrie McAlpin on her Instagram and TikTok and everything. That, that but Instagram? she's in this new. Uh, well, not not new, but she's in two Netflix TV shows. She's in two. And, it's, and last, no, this week we saw her in American Housewives. Her episode aired in American Housewives on that's, ABC. That's crazy. Now, okay, now you have the YouTube channel. Is it Dear Darnell? Yeah, it's Dear Darnell. And I spell Darnell was D A R N E L L. Oh, look at you, Mr. Fancy Pants. <laughs> yeah, I got to be fancy uh, with it. Um, tell me a little bit about the YouTube page. I, I've seen it, but tell me a little bit about it. Okay, so my YouTube page, uh, I like to have fun with it. Like, I just, me and Gavin, well, we have a new YouTube video coming out Monday at 3 p.m. All my videos come out every Monday at 3 p.m. Okay, Monday, Monday, Monday. And it's just been really fun. It's been a drive that everybody has just been helping me, being supportive, and, like, helping me with my intro, my, like, <laughs> just having fun. When like, do one I time get we show on my an episode? Well... <laughs> You gotta, I don't know. <laughs> I want to be on an episode. Sorry. I'll get you on an episode. We can get you on an episode. Okay. okay. <laughs> um, are you doing, because I totally interrupted you. I feel a bad, terrible interview. I just cut you off. My bad about that. It's fine. <laughs> okay, so uh, when we were doing the first video, like, it was just so fun. Um, Walker was showing us albino monkeys the whole time. It's, it's an inside Walker? joke. We like we like it's, we like to talk about albino monkeys and albino. What just in the world joke. is an albino monkey? <laughs> it's just an albino monkey that just looks weird. I'm about to call up Walker right now. <laughs> it's an albino monkey that has like a chain, it's like a hamster monkey. It's just so funny. And then the whole time I was laughing so hard that I was crying, like tears, really hard. Tears come out of my eyes. And they have like, it on ah. Snapchat everywhere. It's just so funny. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, Gavin started crying too because he was laughing too hard. Now I saw you guys in the video. Are now are you making music too? Uh, yeah, I will be soon. I'm, I'm in, going to be going into the studio with Mr. Andrew Lane. Mr. Andrew Lane, like that, bro? Yeah. <laughs> well, dear Darnell. Okay. Okay. Yep. <laughs> See what I did there? See what I did there? Um, okay, so, so now, okay, so now you're still part of GOAT. Um, you do you feel, I mean, do you have any, I mean, people have said that you're taken up for GOAT fam, um, almost like you're their, um, I don't, I don't even understand. Like, I'm there, your friends, what? you're friends with GOAT fam, and you have never had any feelings of racism there. Okay, I've had zero, like, my parents are, like, very, very strict about that, so, like, Miss <laughs> Teresa and Mr. Dave, Miss Teresa's husband, like, they yeah. invite us to their house, we eat dinner there sometimes, it's just so fun, I never felt any type of racial, how do I say it, racial emotion, or, right. I think that's the word, towards them, to yeah. be, to feel like, oh, I don't fit in here, like, they're, they're like, being, yeah, you know, I, I Homie, I felt they just, just I, I don't, I'm speechless. <laughs> I, I literally, because I love asking questions. People get mad at me, but I'm a, I don't take sides. I just ask questions. I ask every black person I knew that knew Goat Fam and Teresa, and they all love them so much. So I don't know what the other people are, what their situation is, but you know, everybody has their truths. And dude, I think you're doing real big things, man. And, and, and thank I'm you so much. 
And, uh, you know, if you ever get bored, you can watch that. We can watch that live together and laugh. <laughs> Just not <laughs> <You know>? like, <laughs> um, okay. So we have the Dear Darnell coming up and you're doing a Netflix and you have maybe music. Yep. So I have Dear Darnell. That's my new YouTube channel. Uh, I have a new coming out Monday at 3 p.m. I have a Netflix project that I cannot say is confidential. A uh, new music music's gonna be coming out. And all right, man. And that's well, it. That's, that's oh, yeah, amazing. and I've and I've been in doing I've that's been right. full skill ball. I did I did uh something for Mace. Okay. And some other stuff that I can't really remember right about now. You're the busiest kid in all of Los Angeles. Okay, my internet's being say that. <laughs> <laughs> my internet's being weird, so I'm gonna wrap this up. Um, okay. Follow my cat Henry, the paparazzi gamer. Henry, the paparazzi gamer. Make sure you follow okay. him. All right. <laughs> and uh, hey, man, I really appreciate you talking to me. You, your sister, your whole family. You guys are real nice.